where do we stand? Are we part of Allah's plan? Or are we standing one side? Like Nabi Musa's people said to Nabi Musa, no, 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 we can't fight. You and Allah, you go and fight. You and Allah go fight the believers while we stay here. Are we going to be like that, sitting one side, sitting on the fence, or get involved somehow at least, somehow make our contribution somehow for the liberation of all the oppressed people throughout the world. And therefore it's necessary for Muslims who are concerned to stand with the truth-loving Christians, stand with the truth and justice-loving Jews, Stand with the truth and justice loving Hindus and people of various religions because there's good people in other religions also. There's good Christians, there's good Jews, there's good Hindus who's not satisfied and happy what is happening in India. Jews who speak out about what is happening and they speak out strongly against the Israeli government than many of us Muslim organizations. So we need to find ways how we can unite, how we can form a common ground with these people who are truth and, and justice loving people and fight injustice and oppression throughout the world.